Good morning, everybody. So, I literally just woke up and I just wanted to say hello. I hope you guys are having a great day or great night or whenever you're watching this. And I have red wine going right here. I guess I slept weird. Crystal got her sister something for her birthday. Her birthday is October 3rd. And she wrapped it last night. Her wrapping is so cute. I wrap really, really bad. I mean, this is good compared to how I wrap. As you guys know, I got these Nature Made Multi Complete Vitamins, and Crystal got the vitamin E. Turns out, vitamin E is actually bad for you. Um, you should only get it via food and not tablet because it causes your chance of a stroke to skyrocket. And it actually makes your problems worse. So I'm a little hesitant on this multi-complete nature made. Um, this is just has every type of vitamin you can think of in here. So I'm just like so confused on if I should take this or not. Crystal's on some app called Twitch. And I guess where you can watch other people play Minecraft and you actually see them in the corner right there playing it. <laughs> so I gotta be honest, since that's what I'm about, Crystal and I were gonna go to McDonald's for our first meal. Um, we already planned what we were gonna get. It was low calorie, but still it's McDonald's. That's a fast food, probably not the best option. So instead I'm like, you know what? Let's just have a quest bar. So I am congratulating myself in this victory. Crystal last night suggested, let's have a cliff bar. And I was like, ew. I guess I woke up with a change of mind. So here's jewelry of the day. You guys are probably wondering why I'm not wearing eyeliner. Because you're used to me seeing. You're used to seeing me with lots of eyeliner. And Crystal and I decided to do this thing. To kind of be out of our comfort zone, I guess you could say. I always wear mascara and eyeliner. Eyeliner is my, like, main shabam. Crystal always straightens her bangs and her actual hair, and her bangs are her main shabam. So we took away our main shabam. She will not be straightening her bangs, and I will not be wearing eyeliner. And we're going to go in public like this, because those are two things that we're very, like, insecure about, and we don't feel comfortable, but we want to try it out and see how it feels. So that's why I'm not wearing eyeliner today. <laughs> So anyways, let's get to my jewelry. I am wearing these red, sparkly, shiny earrings. Um, I don't remember where I got them. I want to say eBay, to be honest. And then I'm wearing this red diamond flower beautiful statement necklace that I got from Walmart. And this red rose and owl ring that I got from ShopMissA.com. And I'm just wearing my hair down. I usually straighten my hair, but I didn't straighten it today. You guys are probably like, but your hair is already straight. What straightening does for me is just, it makes it even more straighter. And it also just takes away the frizz. So my hair is going to be extremely frizzy today, but I'm going to accept it and I'm going to embrace it. If you want to see outfit of the day, just keep it as simple with some pants, <laughs> red flats. A black and white striped shirt. Um, I love black and white and red together. I think it looks really good. And carrying my purse that I got from Target. So, yeah. Just an FYI, I literally suck at filming myself in the mirror. Like, I, I need to practice on my spare time. So, um, if you guys don't know, we're going grocery shopping as per usual. And then we're going out to eat. We were going to go to Panera, but Crystal's dad told us about this one restaurant. It's called, like, Shawnee's? Shoney's? I don't know. So, I think we're going to give that restaurant a try and see how we like it. It's supposed to be, like, seafood and stuff. I don't know.
got our, what are they called? Grocery things, grocery bags. So I had to go get them. Okay, I'll put them in the them back. Whoops. <laughs> Thank you. I love my mom. He he. How sweet. <laughs> Someone's kissing ass. Just arrived at our beautiful grocery store called Wegmans. Oh yeah. Isn't it just so beautiful? It looks like a castle. A flat castle. Grocery haul today is going to be kind of tiny. Only one bag. Whoa. And two bags. Shocking. Yeah. Crystal's the one who always puts away the cart for us. <laughs> so sweet of her. Today in the grocery store, I got complimented on my necklace, which you guys can't see because the seat belt is right in my shirt up. But uh, they said like it's so beautiful, and then they're like, your outfit goes perfect with it. I just thought it was super sweet. And things like that literally make my day. Okay, so we just got home. I did the grocery haul. Now we're um, gonna go leave. We looked at Shawnee's like Yelp, and everything just looks really, really bad on there. So, Shawnee, sorry. Like the reviews just horrible. So we don't know where we're gonna go to eat. We're just gonna wander the streets. Lies. Okay, you guys. I <laughs> what did you say? Lies. Lies hotel. Okay, you guys. I am not a car person at all my brother and my dad are like 100 100 percent and growing up i'm i'm just like not interested but there is this one type of car that i find super cute it's like those square type cars i don't even know how to describe it but there is a car that i actually find sexy and i legit look at it and i say that's a sexy car and i'm about to show it to you guys the color meh but just every everything else about it is like literally perfection, and um, I wish I, I wish it was mine. This is the car right here. Oh my God! I want you. Look at that car, though. In love. So we just got out of our meal, and something is like haunting my mind. So I kind of want to talk about it real quick. <clears throat> Before we went in, there was this girl holding a sign saying that she's pregnant and she needs money and um, she needs shelter and stuff like that. So I'm, I like feel obligated as a person and a human that I need to give her money. And so I did it. I do that for whenever I have money and I see a homeless person with a sign, like it's literally, it just, it hurts. Mainly because homeless, um, I, I um, it's not that I have experience with them, but it's just my dad actually was homeless for a couple years while I was in foster care and I had to see him like that and it literally just really hurt. So whenever I see a homeless person, I remember my dad and everything that he went through. And you know, sometimes, you know, people do ask for money for the wrong reasons. They lie and say they're homeless and they go get alcohol or they go get drugs and things like that. And when I saw her sign, I felt obligated to give her some money, so I did. Um, but when I walked up close to her, I noticed that she had an iPod in her ear and she was like singing along to it. So it kind of made me feel like, did I just make a bad decision? I don't know. I want to hope for the best, like, yeah, she has an iPod, but she plugs it in in the library or something like that. It's just, you never know. People can literally trick you, but then you could also be like saving someone's life. They could be on like the verge of starvation and you give them some money and they can go eat. 
so I don't know I just kind of wanted to share that and honestly if you ever see someone like that and you have you know money whether it's a 20 or a 5 or 1 or change I don't know um, it's just I feel like I'd rather give it to them and then not if that makes sense but that was just kind of weighing on my mind so I wanted to talk about it okay I wanted to show you guys Crystal's screensaver or what is it called like home screen picture on her cell phone I thought it was so cute can you guys see it okay it says get cape wear cape fly <laughs> look at look how cute though oh look at his little face when he's about to fly in his arms <laughs> Crystal and I invented a game, it's kind of like Pictionary or whatever you want to call it, where we ha we wrote down a bunch of different items or people or just anything and we have to like pick a thing and then we have to draw it and the other person has to guess and then we get a point. As you can tell, there's a lot of points going on because we played for like two days. We we're legit obsessed so we're going to play again. Uh, these are all the words and stuff that we've already done. And this is just blank sheets in case we want to come up with more. I'm actually coming up with more as we speak. But it's like so fun, you guys. Like legit addictive. Okay, Crystal's about to draw hers. Yes. I stopped recording when you said that. Oh. <laughs> Darn it. Oh, baby. <laughs> Volcano. Yep. Yay, I got a point. Oh, I'm trying to decide what to do. Drawing. Yes! This is an upside down version of Crystal's cookie jar. Not, that's me who took a bite. Green light. No. Stop light. No. <laughs> Crystal's witch. <laughs> I was trying to draw Lady Gaga. <laughs> Funky hair equals Lady Gaga, right? And I was trying to draw meat because you guys remember when she wore meat that one time? Crystal guessed it already. I don't know how she did it. So I think Crystal and I are just going to sit around and play more of this game that we invented. Well, we didn't really invent it, but you know what I mean. We're just having a lot of fun with it. So I think I'm just going to end my vlog for tonight. And I hope you guys enjoyed it. And I will see you in my next video. Bye.